Local breweries are struggling to put their product on the shelves. Last night we told you about a new brewery in Ord, Scratchtown. The owners want to have their beers in area stores, but it could come at a hefty price for one of the smallest breweries in the state. The grains are grinding, and the beer is flowing at Scratchtown Brewery. It's chilled down to about 65 degrees, and we pitch the yeast, and it ferments for oh, 10 days or so, and then we uh, do some cold conditioning and keg it. But the work is far from over. We want to grow and maintain absolute control on the quality of the product that we serve. While the beer is smooth, the road to bottle Scratchtown beer is full of foam. It's frustrating when I go to hy Bee to buy some of my favorite uh, craft beers down in Grand Island, for example, and the, the liquor manager down there asked me when we're going to be able to distribute because we've got wineries that can walk in and sell direct to retailers, but breweries in the state of Nebraska don't have that option. There are 38 self-distribution states in the country. Nebraska is not one of them. Scratchtown can serve beer to customers from their tap room. We're brewing two, three times a week. But in order to sell their product to gas stations and grocery stores, the Ord Brewery pays a fee to a distribution company. <laughs> A-Law Pollard and his partners would like changed. It allows us as a, as a very small bootstrap startup to, uh, to grow our business more organically and it allows us to uh, save on some of the costs that distribution would cost us so that we can reinvest in the business from a production standpoint to grow. Scratchtown is asking state lawmakers to reform legislation. I can see that the small producer wants to get into other places and it may be hard for them to, to do that. But with the session winding down, the glass is half empty this year. I have not heard any distributor who would not distribute a small breweries beer. Uh, I think the bottom line there is that, of course, they get some money for it, the distribution. We're three small young families that are really interested in how entrepreneurship can change rural America. Another issue Scratchtown mentioned that they're facing taxing. Now, in Nebraska, craft breweries are taxed twice, once for making the beer. And another tax for the sale of beer. State Senator Russ Karpacek says this tax system is necessary to make sure the quality of beer meets standards and that taxes are being paid to the retailer and manufacturer. I hope they're going to grow in this summer. Like we said, they could be getting into distribution business. We'll keep an eye on that And as well. a boost in business for them expected, too. That's